At around 2.30 p.m. on Sunday, January 19th, two young girls were walking in the 400 block of Siena Heights Way southwest. An unknown male came up to them and uh, exposed himself uh, to the young girls. Uh, the young girls uh, immediately tried to distance themselves from this guy. Uh, they were able to see him go and get into a grey sedan and uh, leave the area. The man is described in his 20s, approximately 5'9", with a medium build and medium skin tone. He has facial acne, short dark hair and was wearing dark jeans at the time of the incident. The individual was very unique in description, uh, so that was that was very helpful. Uh, police have posted a composite sketch of the individual, and we're hoping that uh, the public will be able to help us in any way. The young girls did the right thing. They ran away, told their parents, who then called police. I would encourage parents to, to speak openly to their children um, about about things like have, that have occurred. What we don't want to do, though, is, uh, is scare the children into not wanting to approach any adult, um, especially at a time when they may need to do so. Explain to them which uh, adults that are strangers that they can trust. Um, the obvious ones being teachers, police officers. We now tell you about a robbery that took place on December 29, 2013. At around 6.30 p.m., a unique time for a robbery, according to police, Two masked men entered the City Limits liquor store at 484.35 Beaufort Road, Northwest. One armed with a knife and one stood watch while the, they robbed the uh, liquor store of money. Um, both fled on foot, no vehicle was, uh, was seen, um, but uh, CCTV cameras did capture images of the suspects and uh, it's posted on Crime Stoppers. We're hoping that uh, any information uh, on these guys would be helpful. At this time, the only witness was the clerk in the store. On Monday, December 16, 2013, at 2.35 a.m., two unknown males entered the Max Convenience Store at 5720 Silver Springs Boulevard, Northwest. Both armed with guns, one a handgun and one a long rifle. Um, that's pretty unique as well uh, in these types of circumstances. Uh, both males were heavy set build, but one of the males was wearing a very unique Yamaha ski jacket. Uh, this is uh, something that uh, was very uh, evident and visible on, on camera and it's uh, such a unique jacket that we know somebody out there uh, knows that a person uh, wears this type of jacket. So uh, the, these guys came in very aggressive. They were, uh, they were very volatile. Um, they did assault uh, the, uh, the cashier at the time uh, and, and with the guns they were very aggressive. They stole cash, uh, multiple cartons of cigarettes and fled the store. Uh, no vehicle was seen. And remember, if you do witness a crime, be the best witness you can be. Now, Crime Stoppers could pay you a cash reward of up to $2,000 for information on these or any unsolved crimes, the recovery of stolen property, drugs, or the arrest of any wanted person. Your tips are anonymous and completely confidential. You can talk, type, or text your information in. For Go Calgary, I'm Lisa Wolanski.